things I wanted to start off with. That was exactly it. Because people uh, do leave it for last minute. I, I am as guilty as everybody else. Um, and there's some who plan far in advance. But are there even rooms available at this point? There are some um, hotels that still have rooms. Okay, we're talking exclusively Key Cocker? Exclusively Key Cocker. Okay. And uh, it's basically, to be honest with you, it's the more priciest hotels. Okay. But as well, it's the ones that are small as well, that they don't really have the reservation system. Okay. So it's they only have like a phone, and they do reservation the old style that they use. So if you actually don't, have, if you're planning to stay there for the whole weekend, mm -hmm. you can walk there and find like the places like maybe Sandalin and South, such as I'm not sure if they have, but <laughs> they they should have rooms because they have like a reservation system that's not really that you would call there okay. and book. And so nobody can get the room. You just try to yeah. get there early. Yeah. Either early or try to book the expensive hotels that might have some rooms at the moment. <laughs> Now, let's talk about what the island does to prepare for, I mean, Kikaka is notorious for its laid-back style. I mean, you go there, and a lot of people do day trips on the weekends to Kikaka. They just are at the split all day and then come back to Belize City, or some of them spend the weekend. Now, understanding the boost in activity you have around Easter time, what's, what's, how do you prepare for that? Well, um, the... There's different organizations and groups that are having um, events all around the, the island. For instance, we have the sailing club who's having a sailing regatta on Saturday and Sunday. We start off actually on Friday with the Catholic Church who, and their devout, um, their yeah, the procession. The procession, yes. So for the, the to honor the Passion of Christ with so His resurrection and. Um, so they do that on Friday at 3 o'clock. They have a procession around the island. Um, and then Saturday and Sunday they have mass as well. They have mass on Sunday and they even have like an Easter egg hunt. Easter egg hunt. Yeah. You're yeah. yeah. really taking me back to my childhood. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> so we do, they do all of that in, in Key Crocker. Um, mm -hmm. They have a lot planned for the Saturday and Sunday. Um, and we have some flyers actually. I don't yeah. know if, uh, if you Yeah, go ahead and tell us what's going on. Please. Okay, so um, we have like three different sections. I mean, okay. um, the split, as it's popular here in Belize, they have like their own events. Mm -hmm. And some other places like um, the Palapa Gardens, right? They okay. have like their own. And uh, we have the sailing club. Be. Yeah, the sailing club is happening there. So it's it, in the morning. The sailing is happening at Palapa? Palapa Garden. Okay. Where is Palapa Garden? That's um, on the front street on the beach. Okay. Before you reach to the split. Okay. Um, that's, they're doing actually a revival of a sailing club mm -hmm. because um, it, they once had one a few years back, but then everybody just started to come out of it. So it's a revival and we're getting... Um, we're getting from different parts of the country, like okay. from Placencia, San Pedro, all the other sailing associations coming up for this huge regatta in Key Cocker. Oh, that's going to be cool. Yeah, that's going to be on Saturday and Sunday, and mm -hmm. it's really nice because they have, like, it's kids that are from, like, ages 8 to 15, which will be sailing these small little optimist boats. Mm -hmm. And they're also inviting um, pros and yeah, pros. adults. Are they inviting tagalongs to go? Oh, yes, no, everybody, everybody's invited for that. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. So that's one of the events that's taking place. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And then throughout the Saturday and Sunday, um, it's basically music and events. And mm -hmm. we have some um, that are coming, which is the... We, are we for also during the day, like on Saturday, there's going to be... Um, there's going to be different tour shops. For instance, I think there's like Star Tours who are doing local... Um, they are having major discounts because they're trying to make business, of course. But yeah. the, the thing is that many Belizeans don't uh, can afford the, the tour yeah. because they are pricey on the house. Or some whatever. don't even ask prices yeah, because so. we just assume we can't afford them. Yeah. Yeah. Do you have a lot of Belizeans who go out and do tours or key copper? Yes, we do. Yeah. Because they do, they do special tours for them. Okay. And like half day tours, which is good for if you want to party and keep up, you can do it. You know, you wake up late and then you do a day party yeah. after. Yeah. All right. And we also have one specific, well, one of the popular um, sports, which is the um, flyboard 
Uh, uh, Do we have a flyer on this? Because people, I don't know if anybody knows what flyboard is. Let me, they might have, let me see the flyer. Oh, yeah. sure. The flyboard is where the, um, they do like the water jets. Yes. That shoot you up in the air and you can do different. So this is your time for our divisions to try this because it's an aloe promotion. This is right up my alley. You don't understand. <laughs> it should be fun. So this is new to Peacocker. Yeah. It's, yes, it it's, is. And uh, it's like water jets in you. What yeah, kind of skill does it require? Have you tried it? All you need to do up <laughs> as you can stand on two feet and stand up straight. That's all you need to. You yeah. don't top over anything. No, no, it's just um, great you pressure. You have that yeah. you can do and everything, okay. but if you just want to go straight up and down, they do that too. But um, we're trying to promote as well all different water sports, sports. and activities yep. okay. that um, Kikoko offers on a yearly Mm -hmm. basis um like they have the kayaking yeah. you have the um stand up paddle board oh yes, you have yeah the jet skis uh -huh. um different types of things snorkeling mm -hmm. diving everything and we're trying to encourage the local belizeans who are visiting for the easter holiday to try out many of the different tours you have like the banana boat rides yeah. and the tube rides around the island and everything which is really fun so okay. there's always something to do there exactly and uh, how do people find out where to go for these kind of activities well if they if they walk in there they'll be shooted by all the advertisement and then there'll be a couple of, um people who should be at some of the events shortly yeah. they look with advertising these with discounts and great rates and everything like that so there's a lot planned for the Days during the okay. Now let me ask you, what is your recommendation uh, in terms of Belizeans traversing the islands and trying to get the best deals? Do you ask for a Belizean rate everywhere you go? Um, how do you make sure that you can get a good deal when you're trying to enjoy yourself in Key Cocker? Yeah, I guess you just go there and then, of course, to mention that you're a Belizean and mm -hmm. then essentially try to accommodate you guys. Uh, it's true that you'll have tourists all around. Yeah. And uh, um, you just mentioned that you're a Belizean and then they should give you the best deal. Mm -hmm. uh, I would strongly recommend you guys try the um, these DC activities. I would do it myself but I, if I didn't have to work. <laughs> Which one have you tried? Let's find out. <laughs> I haven't tried that at all, but okay. I should if I uh, have time this Easter. Yeah, this hopefully our, our names will be one yeah. of the first time. <laughs> <laughs> so there's a fly board, there's obviously jet skis, kayaks, a paddle board as well. Uh, yeah, there's, there's a there's stand, stand up, oh, there's the kite boards as well. Kite board. Ooh. Yeah, and you can also do lessons in Kikoka too. They, yeah. they, they have lessons and they will be giving discounts on um, lessons. So you're you know, working while well, you're kick off and you're going to do some kiteboarding because yeah. that's, that's intense. Yeah, yeah. there's windsurfing yeah. as well. Uh -huh. too, and Maybe we could try it together. <laughs> okay. <laughs> well, you sign me up for kiteboarding. <laughs> oh, and you can't forget to try a lizard juice when you go to kick off. So, um, let's talk about some of the parties that will be happening. I know yeah, people want to know about that. Some, um, we have, um, I guess we could mention these ones here. Mm -hmm. Yeah, sure. Um, at the split, of course, they'll be having, um, like, a certain bands and things like that. I think that's short, the day and in the night. Okay. And they'll have, like, um, electro song band and things like that. There's also, um, the Kikoker Events Committee, Kikoker Village Council, in association with Henny Kane and Stone Jam Songs. Okay. We're doing something over at the basketball court. That's right where you get off right the water. Right where you get off the water taxi. The water taxi. Yeah. So they're going to have, um, like, an, in the nighttime, going up to like three, maybe four, all depends. And um, they'll have, like, um, Sweet Pain Band there, and they'll wow. have different DJs. So it's you know, everywhere you go on the island, there's sure to be some so kind of party. you're going to drop off your boat <laughs> into your first party. Exactly. And we're just, we're just having a sentient, which is probably going to be. Wow, um, okay. So we're, we're it's the it's a rocking out there. Right. And it's all it takes of everything for to get out the... And the sailing club, they said they'll have some surprises with music and stuff. Wow. Alright, well that so, sounds interesting. And there'll be a lot of different um, games and activities throughout as well. There'll be um, the 
going to have like some coconut games and there's going to be a lot of foods made of coconut and everything which it will be a kind of way to introduce our mini coconut fest that we're going to have in May. So you're going to have a coconut fest? Something like that. It's going to be like an art in the park kind of thing so everything's uh -huh. going to be based on coconut. So we'll have coconut jewelry, food, games, everything. So coconut water? Uh, yeah. <laughs> people really know about that. So it's kickoffer for Easter definitely. Now one of the pluses of Geekhopper, especially for the new city residents, is that if you can't get a hotel, you can always go just for the day. Yeah, for you were mentioning time. before Tracy that the water taxis has some deals. Tell us more yes. about that. The water actually are uh, mainly also San Pedro Express. Mm -hmm. If you have a, a membership sure. card, they have great deals on that for you to go. Oh. And I think their first bird in the morning is like 8 o'clock at least Belize City. Mm -hmm. And the last one at 5.30. You also have like Tropic Air flights that leave 7 in the morning. Mm -hmm. And the last one comes back at 5.10. So. Yeah, it's really early. Yeah. <laughs> Maximize your day. <laughs> so that is always an option for people who just uh, can't get a hotel or don't right. have the money to spend for overnight. Yeah. Great. And uh, anything special for the children? Because it is a family holiday as well. Right, right. That's where the, the swimming club, they're all including. That one is mostly family-based activities and everything. Football. Oh, right. There's the sports committee is having a five-a-side football on the beach right beside the the, the sailing regatta that they're having. So you can get your team set up and go there and they'll have a tournament there, a little marathon. And then you'll have all different types of there's out there as well around the entire island. <laughs> so the I like last of that one. What, what is that about? Please do tell us. Hanukkah. Hanukkah, colors, balikin, lighthouse, everything. So, so what else would you like? I mean, Kikaka needs very little to sell to sell itself. But just uh, for those who are still a little bit undecided, what would you tell them about heading out to Kikaka for this Easter? I think it's. It's a nice trip for the day, if you, especially if you don't find rooms, if you don't want to stay there, or if you have other events or family events during the day. Uh, I mean, you could just go there. And Geekhopper is basically catering for, um, I think Everybody. it's, it's okay. economic. I mean, you could have fun with the yeah. minimal money that you want to spend there. You could still find